Oh, let's see here. Good morning to myself and the clown man. What is it? 5.40 in the god dang morning. Um, ugh, I'm so irritated. I'm like never going to be able to sleep it again. Literally. Um, so I went and met up with some probation officer that's, I guess, isn't even mine. And I got put on the colors program. For anyone that doesn't know what that is, that is when you get into some legal turmoil and you have to call in every single day to see if you have to go down to your probation office and take a urine sample and um, blow in a breathalyzer. This is day two and I'm headed down there. It's on 84th and Spring Street. So annoying. Literally. Because with my luck, oh, my number will get called every single damn day. Um, even though it didn't get called the first day. Oh, here we go. Dude. This sucks. Um, it's freezing. It's 15 degrees. Like, I'm freezing. And I'm going to Starbucks so I can get a coffee and a venti ice water to suck down so I can pee. Hopefully it's not crazy in there and I hope that it's... Ugh, there's all those crackheads in there. I hate it. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Like, um, what was it? Monday. Yeah, Monday. It was yesterday. Um, I had to go in there for my first one. And it took forever because I could not pee. I just sit there for like an hour and wait to be able to freaking pee. Um, and then this dude that was in there was asking me if I did dope. Do I look like a dope fiend? Not anymore. I look like a clown, motherfucker. Um, but those are the people that are in probation. Like... It sucks so bad. And I'm going to have to do this for two, at least 18 months. I hate it. 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 Already. But on the upper hand, I mean, I'm up at six o'clock in the morning and I wish I, you know what? I wish I have. I mean, I can't wait till I will be able to just go to the gym like after this kind of situation because that's pretty much like all I can do. I don't work till 11. Where am I going? Oh yeah, this way. I don't work till 11. <clears throat> Ooh, so cold. Okay, it's what? Wednesday? Ugh! I need it to be Friday. Like it matters, you don't get a day off. I literally have to call Sunday through Sunday through Sunday through Sunday and then through Sunday. <sighs> Oh, but this is what I'm saying. Like, at least I, you know what? I, I always ask. See, this is what I don't understand about the universe. Like, the universe gives you something. Gives you exactly what you want. But not specifically in the correct way. That's why, like, I feel like, I don't know, Satan's intertwined with the universe. Well, and like, I feel like so God is too, but sometimes, like, I was asking if I can, you know, I just need some sort of direction. I just need someone to tell me what I need to be doing in my life to make myself more successful, blah, 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 blah. And what happens? I got another DUI and I have a probation officer in the state of Nebraska telling me what to do. I mean, yeah, it sucks so bad but you know I have to be held accountable to get myself somewhere almost every single day pace like I have to do all these things plus I need to work my three jobs right now like I basically have four jobs right now newest one being probation and I actually have to pay them they don't pay me Ugh. I'm so Cold. Starbucks is coming up. 
thank goodness. So, I, well, I'm pretty, I mean, not disappointed, but, I mean, I can't drink. Like, there's no way. Like, there's no way I can drink. Because if I, unless I go out of town, which I cannot wait to go out of town now. Like, I cannot wait to go out of town. Like, I, when I go out of town, like, I'm going to get fucked, probably. Because <laughs> I literally cannot. Uh, it's just the people in there are disgusting. Like they're sick, nasty, crackheads. Um, but. Through all this, I mean, at least 18 months, I'm going to try to get off earlier. Like, the earliest they said I could get off is 18 months. I don't know. I want to, like, I'm going to try to get out earlier than that. Literally. Like, literally going to try to get out earlier than that. For sure. Because 18 months, I don't think I, oh my gosh. Like, just send me to jail. My lawyer obviously sucked. Didn't do anything for me. Um, so, this is what I get. And I'm not worried about the money part, because hopefully, like, all my jobs incorporated will just balance out. But I have got to watch my finances this year. I have to see exactly where every single penny goes. I mean, I did make one large purchase again. Um, I did make, um... I did buy some really, really expensive shoes, but I don't know. I like cannot, I do not fit into like any of my clothes right now. And if a $300 pair of shoes is going to like get me through, screw it. Cause it's going to look good with my DSL sweatshirt, my trench coat, my pants. Um, can I get a venti iced Americano with almond milk and hazelnut syrup and then a venti ice water? Okay, we'll do almond milk, hazelnut, and water. What else for you? Um, and then that's it. All right, we got it going. Thank you. Well, that's what I get. It's a ghetto. Not ghetto, I don't say that anymore. It's a bougie latte. Bougie ass latte. I get to go to Biagi's for dinner with my third job today, which I'm so excited about. I love Biagi's. I'm gonna get the steak and shrimp and some steamed vegetables. I might try some gluten-free pasta. I don't know. Like, thank goodness we work with this doctor. She's gluten-free, keto. She's a keto queen. Um, but I'm gonna try to stick to the keto. I could totally do it. I just don't know. I don't like synthetic sugars, though. No, thank you. Thank you. somewhere because I just had it.
Oh, I did put it back in my pocket. <sighs> I have so much going on in my mind, I really just need to relax. It'll be fun. All right. Thank Are you. you. Yeah, you gave me something. Okay. Yes. Thank you so much. I just need to calm down. I will be fine. About to have a freaking mental breakdown! Not really, I put them upon myself. I just even squirm around looking for my freaking thing and I, it's right here, Anthony. Calm the F down, it's right here. Ugh, I'm not gonna litter, littering so bad. Yeah, it's starting to warm up. Yeah, so I'm gonna chug this shit. And what now? I'm gonna be up all freaking morning and then be so tired when I get off work. Hopefully not though. Um, I probably should, I mean, the doctor, I call her the doctor. Um, Dr. Lee Merritt, who I work with at Enlightened Omaha, is great because she truly believes like in the eastern medicine right western no we're the west no western medicine so more natural ways to like help build your immune system and not become sick and ill <laughs> sorry i had to spit sick i hate when i have to spit um she write, she wrote she wrote a couple books and they're actually really really interesting about like what to do since um since Obamacare and like once it's gone like what do you do um just certain little things but she's like she looks at other things instead of just taking prescription medicine even though like um hi doctor can you please write me a slim quick prescription please um we're going to test my adrenal soon and she said with the there's probably a very low percentage of my adrenals and then hormones are all out of whack since um, I've lived such a crazy life and now I'm like not. It's actually, my body's all messed up. Like, it's so crazy. Like I started sleeping <laughs> and it, which is good, but I feel like it's just, put my body out of sorts because I never used to sleep like this. Like, I can't even remember the last time I was, so, like, I used to sleep, like, I, like, would stay up for three days sometimes on a bender and, like, just, you know, sleep one whole day and then, like, party the week away. Like, I would sleep on Sundays. Sundays was my day for sleep. Um, and I used to just... My, like my, my, and the funniest thing is like in the past months I haven't heard my mom tell me I'm burning my candle at both ends which is just funny to me because I used to just be like shut up mom but literally I was torching a, like a birthday candle at both ends that's I mean no it was a pretty long candle I would say it was definitely like a thick candlestick <laughs> that actually lasted about 10 years but then I started sleeping like all the time. Like I was like sleeping all day um, and all night I was like sleeping in. I mean, I felt like it was somewhat of a depression coming down and off of everything that I have. Um, and then, um, you know, it's just a complete turnaround. It's different. It's something really, really a different way that I was living like all of a sudden I would say it's already been January, March, four months since I straight up was like nothing no more nothing I can't do anything anymore um, and then when I do I get I turn into like a crazy person which I do not like I do not like being that crazy person just because I'm on some sort of substance so I just don't do anything and honestly, I did lie to my um, people because the probation 
situations. Like, I don't need any extra things on my plate right now. And with probation, I've been on probation before. You have to... I don't know. They're not going to, like, really listen to you. It's like, I can't wait to meet... I really was kind of upset because of the real probation officer I'm supposed to have, her name is Vicky, and she's not here right now. Like, she's on a leave, and I just feel like I probably would have connected way more with her than this stepping dude that's here right now. I gotta drink this whole entire water real quick. I'm telling you, if I'm not able to pee, when I get to this freaking place, I'm gonna be pissed because I won't be able to piss. Um, but I don't know, like this guy, guys are just different. Like I just think, I don't know, the, the man's mind is just, I don't know, I feel like it's unsincere, it's not warm. This guy, I feel like is just doing a job And I haven't obviously connected with him like I do the ladies, obviously. Um, but hopefully it gets better because I would love not to have to lie through this because... I really would love to live in my truth and not have to remember the lie when it comes down to it. Like, I really do hate lying because I was like a little filthy little, actually slick. I I mean, I, let's be, I was pretty slick. Um, criminal as a child, I feel like I was a smooth criminal. Smooth, smooth, smooth criminal. I got away with everything. And my mom was telling me, she's like, I know you were lying to me. And I was like, okay. <laughs> but I really wouldn't. I would, like, she'd ask me things like, what are you doing tonight? Who are you going with? And I honestly was like, I don't know, because I never really knew. Like, I really didn't have a plan, and I never stuck to any plans. I mean, now I'm like, Thank goodness I have a car now. I don't know what I would do. I'd be screwed right now. I hope I'm the first one here. Oh my gosh. Please to the urine gods. Please let me be. Please. I don't want to wait in that disgusting room. Please let me pee when I get there. I like woke up obviously and I took a like the longest morning pee and then I like wasn't awake yet and then I was like, "Oh my god." Like, I just peed. I can't pee till 6 o'clock in the morning now. And like, oh my gosh, I've always complained. Like, I just need to be put on a schedule and then I'll, I'll be fine. Okay, so now my morning schedule. Um, get up, throw a cute outfit on, spray yourself with some perfume because you're going to look and smell better than every single person in this building. Ew, my nose is so dry. And then you don't get to pee until you find out if you have to drive to 84th and Spring or not, okay, at 6 a.m. So, I guess instead of, the, I don't know, nightly chats, I'm just gonna chat to myself as much as possible. Oh, and I'm, oh, I really want a computer really bad, I think, so I can learn how to edit. And, um, just for myself anyway. And save my videos, because sometimes YouTube, you go to upload it, and then it goes all berserk, and it won't, 
let you download it. And then I've lost a couple videos. I've lost two videos that I was dying to figure out what they were. And I couldn't figure out what they were because I had to delete them. Whoa. Oh, are these people beating me? Beat me, beat me, beat me. Oh, God. The lineup is real. The lineup is fucking real.